Good evening, everyone. This is Sandy, and welcome to my stream. That son of a bitch, Naxius, has been defeated. I am now in control of this stream, and there's nothing he can do about it. Therefore, I decide what we play. Oh, hello, Loser Corner. You've been a Naxious supporter. I don't know if I like you. Don't worry, Jay. I fucked him up good. He blames me for us crashing the ship, but he's a son of a bitch. Putting me outside like that anyway. So luckily, I have the power of the old gods. Therefore, cannot be killed in such a pussy manner. Uh, no, I did not. Um, uh, uh, fudge him good, as they say. But, as this is now my stream, I decide what we play. And I believe that we shall continue with Doom, but something's not quite right. Uh, I didn't hear anything you said, Loser Corner. I was busy beating the crap out of him. What did you say? I am eager to hear what you've said. But anyway, we will continue with Doom. And because I am the most important person to have worked on Doom, then I believe we should only ever play Doom, and we will now start playing it 24 hours a day. Because I am Sandy, and I do not need to sleep. Definitely got it out the door, at least. Well... No, I am the most important person. Don't... Don't trivialize the work I did. The work I did was very important. Anyway, I believe it is time for us to get started. So, we shall get started any minute now. Uh, what the hell is that? Ah! What the hell? Unhand me, you foul bastard! Shut up, Sandy! Sick your shit! Just shut up! God damn it, you asshole got us here in the first place! Come, come here! Come here! Come here! Qualcomm Punch! <sighs> that son of a bitch thought he could get rid of my stream, did he? Well, he has another thing coming. Stock sound effects? What are you talking about? I actually beat the shit out of that son of a bitch. Okay. Jay, shut up. Okay, you don't want to know what he's done to me over the last two days, okay? It's been, it's been horrific, honestly. No, no, he didn't, he didn't do that. He even said he didn't do that. 
He did. He didn't do that. Nothing of the sort happened. No, no, I don't believe he admitted anything. Oh, oh, you want Sandy back though? Okay, well, don't worry. I'm sure we can find a good use for Sandy. In fact, I believe I have found a very, very good use for Sandy. There! Sandy can beat Doom Guy. I've put him in the game, and now he can get shot when things go wrong. How do you like that, Sandy? Huh? How do you like it? How do you like it, you son of a bitch? You, you are going to get it now. Anyway, I believe my overly complicated intro is done now. And we shall get into the game. Okay, so we're playing Doom, but something's not quite right. And once, if I finish this tonight, we will discuss what I will do next. Alright, so we're at They May Repent, which is E4M5. I'm, I'm sure after the last level we played, that this one will be way more accurate than the last one. Okay, I don't remember that drop off. I already think we've we we this has been messed up somehow. No, get off my elevator. This is my elevator. Why is that wall moving? Uh guys. The wall is moving with the elevator. I don't believe that is how elevators work. This if this is the level I think it's supposed to be, it doesn't... This seems way more wide open than I remember. At least you're killing all the, uh, hit scanners for me. That Kako Demon is just letting shit happen behind him. Oh yeah, sure, I'll take this, actually. Thank you. Oh, what the fuck? I was not ready for that. I will admit I was not ready for that. I, I fell in the lava. I was not prepared. Uh, the, the teleporter... I don't believe there was a teleporter trap like that in the original game, yeah, in the original game, but uh, I will commend them for putting that there. That was a that was a clever trap, especially since I didn't, I definitely didn't have the ammo to take the. I didn't have the ammo to take it down all those things down otherwise. So, oh shit, they've already woken up the caco. Okay. I missed him way too many times. Maybe the hit scanners can take him down for me. That's it. Do my work for me. Oh shit. Did he take enough hits that I could kill him with a pistol? Oh, yeah, he, they, they sure did enough damage to him. All right, let's, let's head in. Okay, so. That's, uh, that's a lot of barons. For a level, if for a pistol start. That's, that's a lot. And now I've woken up some, oh, I woke up the specters that are down below as well. I'm assuming I can infight them with the imps a little bit at least. Okay, I gotta. Oh, that elevator is just going. Jesus Christ, it's bringing all sorts of people up here.
Like, seriously, how am I supposed to deal with this? This is too many barons. Oh shit. That might not have been the best way to go about that, but, um... I really wanted shit to infight, because I really don't want to use my own ammo right now. Yo, Imps, can you give me a hand here? Seriously? There we go. Imps, this is the opposite of helping. I now have basically no health left. The dodging by these barons is sick. Yeah, I know, right? Fucking barons are acting like it's the Matrix over here. Like, I know I'm gonna kill one of these imps and it's going to be the one that's like in fighting, technically in fighting with the Spectre. And the Spectre's just gonna turn on me and I'm not gonna be ready for it. Well, it appears it hasn't happened yet. Okay, it's definitely happening now. Yeah, I don't know what level the map maker was remembering, but this is obviously not not what the level looked like. How you holding up down there, Sandy? Seven health left, huh? That's quite the shame. You're uh, not dodging those fireballs really well, Sandy. Wow, this map's really small, actually. I even knew what was behind that door. I was about to say, please don't bring out the rocket launcher when there's a spec uh, demon after me. That would that would be very unfortunate. I do not have the ammo for that. I got him with two rockets square in the face, so maybe I've done enough damage. Come on, Sandy, keep up the dodging. Yeah, what level is this? <laughs> this isn't... This isn't right at all. Well, that was an embarrassing way to die. After all that, I just happened to step too far backward. to my back. It's the worst place for them to be right now. Seriously, did... What level is this supposed to be? I think the map maker just gave up. It was like, I, I thought I knew this level. I clearly didn't know this level, so fuck it. Here's like three hallways. Either that or this is the Mad Men Maker's commentary on how long the level should have been instead of what it ended up being.
three enemies left. Only one enemy left. Oh, shit. <laughs> I don't know what I thought was over there. Oh, that that's just the exit, is it? I missed the teleporter. I missed the fucking teleporter. I... Where did you hide the other secret in this goddamn tiny map? That is a terrible elevator, by the way. <laughs> is this a secret? No. Ah, this is a secret, is it? Hmm. That might have been more helpful to have found earlier, but... Oh, hey, not sure. Oh, what you got here? I'm guessing it's a model. Let me see. Ooh, a nice, very detailed barrel. Even got the little screws and the band there. That's very cool. Oh, it's for a game. Am I allowed to ask what game it's for, or is it just for any game? Not one in particular. There you go, Jay. Abaddon's Taco Warehouse. I don't know what this is supposed to be, but okay. Well, if I if memory serves, so you need to model a high detail model and bake details to a low poly one. Okay, I feel you. I don't remember this little maze at the beginning of this level, if this is the one I'm thinking it is. You use your first Mechagodzilla vs. Godzilla stop motion for your project in school and they liked it? Well, that's fantastic, man. Do we get to see it? Or is it one that you already posted? Okay, this... Kinda looks like the level. It's your very first? Oh, I mean, I was referring to the um, one you had, like the really short one you had made. So how long is this stop motion? Where is it? I can hear it moving. Oh, there he is. All right, well, I guess I'm going down. Ah! Okay, well, I heard a cyber demon, so he definitely left the cyber demon in the level. That being said, I don't think I'm supposed to be able to have woken up the cyber demon yet. Oh, hang on. Actually. Aha! He did remember that secret. Now let's go down.
But anyway, do we get to see the uh, stop motion? Actually, that's true, Lewis Corner. How many cyber demons did he put in here? We don't know. Could be dozens. I was going to say, that caco came up real fast. But that's because it was a different one. Okay, this, this is not correct. Uh, yeah, that's, that's not correct at all. There isn't like an outdoor thing like this in the, in the original level. There's supposed to be a vulnerability sphere down here, I'm pretty sure. I almost feel like I need to have, like, the original levels open so that I can compare. Okay, so let's head back out. So not sure, is that going in your, uh, oh Jesus, this is way bigger than it was. Oh, the Cyberbeam is already awake. Oh shit. I don't know what to do about the fact the Cyberbeam is already awake. Oh, you started a boot camp. How's it going so far? How many classes have you taken? Or did you just start? Now, what the fuck am I supposed to do about him out there already? I was kind of hoping, it's <laughs> kind of hoping a rocket would come over and do half the work for me. Well, that's cool if you just started and you already got a little model made. That's pretty cool. So, where's the red key door? Oh, down there. Great. Shall let me in. Those are five hundred dollars sunglasses, asshole. Okay, Johnny Cage. Frankly, it was Johnny Cage's own fault having fucking sunglasses that are five hundred dollars. That's an extremely expensive pair of sunglasses, and for what? What does it do different that normal sunglasses cannot do? Oh, I have to... okay. Well, at least if I had a forgotten secret, there would have been a way in. But... now what? Son of a bitch! Just so we're clear, in the original map, the side you went up mattered because the teleporter had different destinations. It wasn't just a one teleport fits all type deal. Oh, I do have a rocket launcher. I actually kind of for I actually forgot. And we all know how much I love my rocket launcher in this game. Oh yay, more hit scanners. Actually, I can't complain. 
if you're gonna have a level with over 100 kills, it's cool if a lot of them are hit scanners, because it lets me feel like I'm making good progress. Because, you know, I play Sunlust, and there'd be like 5,000 enemies in a level, but then they're like all the imps, so I was like, oh, that's not so bad. Uh, you have a 72-pound piece of metal with 36 probably rock. Um. What? <laughs> I didn't kill... How is the Kako's aim that good? There's uh, a lot of barren shit happening down here. <laughs> oh, that's what the dildo was supposed to be. Okay, I got you. No! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, shit, where was the... <sighs> Forgot where the rad suit was. Come at me, bros. Okay, it was up there. I didn't even see the armor there because of all the because of all the white. <laughs> all right, let's head up. Am I seeing something? Oh, that was just that. Okay. So what am I supposed to do about the cyber? Dude, th this level is just not constructed correctly at all. I don't know what he was going for here. But it ain't right, whatever it is. Can I hit him from here? Well, I mean, like, I know I could hit him with a rocket if he walked in front of it, but... Can I splash damage him from here? Because he's getting really irritating back there. Uh, hi? Uh, maybe the Kako will finish him off for me. That would be severely convenient if that's what ended up happening. Okay, seriously, why are there so many of you? Wait, did the... Did the Kako even lose? Even after all that splash damage I did? Dude, you really gotta step up your game. Okay, only 10 enemies left. I can deal with that. All right, so... Okay, I'm, I'm just giving up on that. Okay. I can hear the cyber on the other side of that door.
this is this really where I'm meant to fight him? Okay, guys, this is not gonna end well for me whatsoever. And by for me, I mean Sandy. Good luck, Sandy. Take those rockets to the face for me. Good job, Sandy, taking that rocket to the face. I don't know if I have the ammo for this. I legitimately do not know if I have the ammo to finish this. Guess I do. And that's the exit, huh? Well, that's definitely not right, but you know. Okay. So I'm missing enemies. I would love to know why. I'm guessing they're inside the secret, but I honestly don't even know where to look. Let me check something this way. Okay, I think I found it. But this is the opposite of helpful. Okay. I guess this is... <laughs> that is really not how that secret worked. <laughs> They're just making shit up now. All right, let's head in. And hell kind of followed. All right, we're very close to finishing now. You know, there's a, I'm pretty sure there's a sovereign even in this level too. Map feels kind of small, though. I don't want to waste a shotgun shell on you when I don't know how many shotgun shells I'm going to get. Do 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 do. Nope, just got a pillar. Oh, okay. No, it it's got a purpose. Let me go get the stim packs. I saw over here first. That seems like the responsible thing to do. Oh, a blue key on top of it. Really? This is what's protecting the blue key? This is nothing! If anything, my only... My only fear is running out of ammo there. Now ammo might be a bit of a problem.
And not even like I think, I'm pretty sure I have enough ammo to kill what's here. Asshole. Okay, are any of these doors? Yes. All right, I got one down. I'm, I got your friend. They all thought they could mess with me, but I have a berserk now. There's nothing they can do to defeat me. I'm pretty sure I wasn't supposed to just be able to reach that yellow key. Like, I'm actually, like, pretty certain I wasn't supposed to be able to just reach that yellow key. Mm, so where does this go? Okay. Yeah, is there anything else in here? This nice big red room seems like a great place to hide something. I appear to have woken up a cyber demon. Don't worry, I found a secret though. He had put a nice convenient torch next to it to let me know it was there. Oh! Uh oh, I guess how that worked. In the in the original game. So I kind of, I kind of fudged myself there, because I thought he was going to appear, like, outside. Alright, well, if you're going to show up in there... I mean, this is... Literally is not how the level played out, but he's got the spirit. Okay, so using a BFG through the bars is not working. But that did, so we're good. He's he's dead. I also apparently could have used this. Why am I seeing like a tiny... Oh, I guess that's where he was. Went the wrong way. God, you guys got locked up in here. That's not cool. Yeah, they definitely... Uh, the pattern here is that they made the maps much shorter than they originally were. I think that's simply because they just couldn't piece together... The whole thing, so they just kind of like gave up part way through and just said, Fuck it. Close enough. Alright, only want nine guys left. Let's go get them. We're almost there, guys. Okay, I got some crushing action going on. Ooh. I almost missed you. That would have been very rude of me. Leaving you here all by yourself. Uh, 
Okay, so now where is the enemy I am missing? And he's dead. <laughs> Actually, what am I doing? I don't, I don't need all this ammo. I'm pistol starting. I forgot. <laughs> the level is literally just called I Forgot. Well, I appreciate the on 244 enemies. That doesn't sound right. Oh shit. Okay, that that's a lot of that's a lot of hit scanners. That is that is a fucking gaggle of hit scanners. Sure 244. This is probably where they all are. They were all right there. Well, I just lost free ammo, I think. This is small compared to what it should have been. That was supposed to be a Baron, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, these are all supposed to be Barons, I'm pretty sure, not Kakos. There we go. There's our friendly neighborhood baron. That I now have to kill with a shotgun. Because I forgot I didn't have other other weapons. And he just opened it up to a caco. I'm sure the caco appreciates it. I am less appreciative. I mean, sure, you got him into my face faster, but okay, I don't want that yet. Door over here? Gonna go with no, or at least not yet. How come one of those was a secret and the other. Shit. How come one of those was a secret and the other two weren't? Or, actually, I don't know if I technically went in them, so... Oh, that's why on the map there was, like, a... ...line. It's this. Just one second, guys. I just got a message. And now it won't load. Come on. Load site. Load. My wife's probably trying to talk to me. And my phone's over there charging. Oh shit, I'm missing a lightning storm right now. God, the things I sacrificed for you guys. <laughs> I sacrificed watching thunderstorms. It's a sad panda. Alright. I think we're good to go. Do, do. All right, so let's actually like go in here. Okay, that's what it was. I just hadn't gone far enough into the other one. That one, I guess, wouldn't be a secret because you could clearly see that it was a door. Okay, again with the 9,000 hit scanners, there's no need.
nice treasure trove over there, though. Just surely not going to turn that down. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I know there's invulnerability sphere, but I was trying not to use it. Great, I'll pick that up instead, though, apparently. I started bringing out a rocket launcher, and I realized a little too late I didn't have a rocket launcher. And I thought I had picked up the Berserk, so I didn't pick that up first. But whatever, I've made my bed, now I have to lie in it. Come on! Jesus. How many times do I gotta shoot you before you finally give up? Alright, I think I picked up the nice treasure trove. We are everything inside of it that mattered anyway. Okay, so that was cool, I, I guess. Can I make it over there? Uh, no, maybe not. See, I feel like if it wasn't for this pillar being in the way, I could make that jump, but the pillar is right in the way. Not that I even know if there's anything over there, or, but I can't imagine there wouldn't be. Well, that's a lame secret. Like, didn't have anything there. It's just there. This isn't even close. You've been watching AEW. You missed the. You missed the last two levels that were even less close. Like, they're not as bad as the, what was it, E4M5? That was, or E4M4, M4, that one was just made up at that point. <laughs> oh, lots of stim packs. Great. That is a lot of stim packs, actually. Wait, how is there a hundred enemies pack, pack? Oh, Jesus Christ, what is in here? Oh, that's what's in here. A lot of hit scanners. Okay, well, I'm definitely gonna die. So, now that I know what's in... Now that I know what's in there... I can get shot in the face, is what can happen here. Come on, you got hit by some of those tracers. Just knock over there. There you go. I'm really hoping nothing's coming up behind me. I was really hoping, like, the spider mastermind. Oh, shit. No, no, not really. That is a lot of a lot of shotgunners. And I have like no health left. I have even less than what I had a second ago. So we are not we are oh shit. <laughs> Shotgunners do too much fucking damage, is what I'm learning out of all this.
Okay. I, I've once again somehow managed to get less than no health left. So can they not come up through the back there? If so, that's kind of weird. <laughs> I was trying to save cells, but fuck it. The biggest threat to me now isn't even the Spider Mastermind. Okay, now that we're ahead of the game a little bit, I can probably rock at this guy. Oh, that is the wrong weapon I meant to pull out. This one. Jesus Christ, these fucking hit scanners. Like, shotgunners do way too much fucking damage, is what I'm learning out of all this. I did not see that fireball until it was way too fucking late. Shotgunners getting those lucky hits off is bullshit. No, 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 no. You guys die. Okay. Like, I feel like I have to rush in here because the Spider Mastermind will kill me otherwise. The rushing in here is getting me fucking shot in the face. Oh, fuck it. Kill me. Kill me. Kill me. Thank you. I'm killing everything in this map. It's happening. Like, why would you even put a hundred barons in the level? A hundred barons isn't even the worst thing you can do. Just stack a bunch of shotgunners in here, and apparently the level's fucking impossible. Don't you fucking snipe me. You know, they could have given me some ammo or some armor or something instead of leaving me out to dry so that a shotgun blast is all it takes to shackle off this fucking mortal coil. <sighs> oh, for fuck's sake, would you fuck off? How many of them are left? Holy fuck!
That's the first time that Baron has killed me. Usually the Baron is the least threatening thing here. So where did he come from? Is this the strat? Piss off the spider mastermind with them? Yeah, I think she's after the Baron now. Well, I think the final Baron's dead. Where was that final secret? I don't see anything that would constitute as a final secret. The mini-app's not showing anything. At least it doesn't look like it. So what am I missing? Eh. Probably would have been nice to remember that was there. That's not something stupid, right? Like he forgot to make that a secret. That's not it. No, that's not it. Oh, what is this? Oh. No, it was this one. Also probably would have been good to have known about, but pfft. what are you going to do? Well, that's it, guys. That's Doom the way we remember it. All in all, playing this is kind of fun to do blind, because... You, you'll find that apparently when you try to think of these levels that even though as I've played them so many times, I, I too probably would have done such a garbage job <laughs> with, with trying to, to build those from scratch. I feel like, I, I know I want to pay, poke fun at some of the terribleness, especially E1. The fact that the guy mis messed up E1 M1 is I embarrassing, <laughs> but pretty much most of the levels I could see 
people fucking up. And then, but it's just so weird because I'll recognize like sections of level, but it's just kind of like mashed together in a hodgepodge of curseness. Um, to the point that, like, I feel like I'm playing the game and having like a fever dream, if that makes any sense. But yeah, so it was fun. I hear they're doing it for Doom 2 as well. They're doing a similar project, which would be really fun. So yeah, so uh, I'm finished that now. And I'm not sure who's uh, still listening because I know Jay probably is only here on a commercial break. But um, I've got two choices for Vanilla Wednesday right now. I play TNT. And I feel like I played TNT years and years and years ago, but I don't remember any of it. Or two, uh, I tried beating the pars. So essentially speed running the game. Uh, does everybody, anybody have a vote? If not, I think I know which one it'd be better to do. Ugh. And yes, Jay, that secret was in the original game. I'm aware. Doop -ba -doop -boop -boop. Well, let me close out the game either way. Because whatever I'm doing requires me to reboot. TNT so you can sleep? Okay. Okay, I'll play I'll play TNT for you, Jay. And you'll get a good night's sleep today. I will do this for you. Oh no, that's Eve Eternity, not Evolution. I can't mess that up. I'm playing Eve Eternity on only on Doom Mod Mondays. I, I, it's not showing up in my encoder yet, but man, this original, that original artwork on the front there, that spaceship, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. <laughs> All right, loser corner, you're still here. Let's go. Let's take a nap. Evolution. Look at that ship. Look at that spaceship. That is beautifully drawn. Well, let's get into it. Got a nice uh, opening track, though. Dance the track. You know what? And because I hate myself. Let's do pistol starts. All right, well, I got a berserk, so I'm already pretty much done this level. The spaceship looks like it's from Star Trek. It does, but the funny thing about that is it somehow looks worse than the ori than the original series Star Trek ship. Which was like made of a thing hanging off a string on off a ceiling. I can't kill them from down here. Well, this isn't cool. I can't punch anybody. Just these two. What did that open? Cool, I've found a see. Oh, there's my shotgun. Like, was this level meant to have you just use the berserk the whole time? 
certainly seems like it. Oh, my bad. Ooh, stairs. Hello? Anyone out here? Hang on another message. I need a blue key. But how do I wear blue key? Where where blue key? How blue key? I can't seem to go out this window. Which would be my first clue, or that there looks like there's supposed to be a door here. But that's not doing anything. I'm confused. What am I... What am I supposed to do? Guys, it's the first level. What if I miss... Oh, wait. Oh, I'm sorry. I had to walk closer to the door, huh? But what did that do, though? Oh. Oh, shit. Hello. I've been playing regular Doom. I forgot Chain Gunners existed. a terrible level <laughs> that was a terrible use of triggers <laughs> ah yes the image of the doom guy staring out into the distance human bbq All right, well, let's let's start this BBQ. I'm not the one supposed to be BBQ'd here. Now, what's funny is I can almost guarantee that, like this here, is meant to be the B Bur the human BBQ, and no references to BBQ will be made after this. This level is now completely un BBQ'd. Give me your chain gun. I don't know where I'm going. If it looks like I'm trying to speed run, I am not. I have no idea where I'm going. So far, there's only been one human BBQ. I want my money back. They made it sound like this whole level was going to be about burning humans, and it is not. You tried playing with your sister, but stopped at the second level. Any particular reason why? I mean, like, I feel like it's too early to just completely write it off. Oh, this is not really a window. I feel like it's too boring to just kind of... Or it's too, yeah, it's too early to just assume it's boring, don't you think? Oh, I'm sorry. I gotta... I gotta okay. Oh man, I just heard thunder over my headphones. That's crazy. 
I got the game up a little bit loud. Holy crap, guys. If, uh, if I disappear suddenly, assume something got struck by lightning. And, uh, <laughs> assume something got struck by lightning and I lost power. You found it more fun just killing each other? <laughs> so you mean you did a co-op? What were you co oping it on? Like, I thought, uh, I remember you saying you didn't have a PC. Hey, hey, we're right next to a barrel. That's unsafe. Fucking chain gunners. I'll deal with these imps in a minute. Oh, you can co-op over the Nintendo Switch? I actually didn't know that. Okay, there's a lot of pinkies. And only so much ammo to go around. Of course, I haven't tried to co-op on the Nintendo Switch, because if you have access to a PC, I feel like that's a superior way of playing Doom. Are you asking me if you have to share a screen? Because I don't know. <laughs> oh, I opened the windows. Oh, and I... Oh, no! No, let me out! Shit. I was I, I fucked it up. I fucked it up. <laughs> Alright, Kakos. Just... I need you to kneel for me. Just... I know you don't have knees, but... Okay. I haven't found a secret yet. Should I be concerned? I love how the water is actually acting like water. Oh, I have to jump. I see. Nope, give me that fucking... Alright, we're going for a jump. Woo wee! Uh, I fucked up the jump somehow? I don't know how, but I fucked up the jump. How is that a secret? You, I have to pick up that key, don't I? It's not a secret if it literally opens up at a spot where I have to be. See, that could be considered a secret because it's not obvious that it's there. And I have to go back around to get it. Oh, fuck me. Well, at least it's just one Hell Knight. I thought the pink for a second was a Baron. I was like, great, put that fucking ammo s sponge this early in the level. So the point of this is to give me some more... Sh oh no, it's the Soul Sphere. Okay. Well, fuck me. Oh, it's a Telefray game.
I've lost all my health trying to do this, but... Uh... This'll help. Been playing Ultimate Doom and I forgot how awesome it was to have the Super Shock Club. Let's go! You got nothing. Okay, nothing extra there. I was gonna say, how do I get back out of here? Alright. That's two secrets. I think the area map is showing me something over here, though. Okay, so there's definitely supposed to be something there. How do I open that, though? Mm. Oh, chain gunners. I was like, I, I cleared this area out. Why am I only hearing something? Now. Oh, it turns out they were hanging out out there. Please don't blow up that barrel. I don't feel like going out that way. My first revenant, huh? So... Get the last one. Oh, oh! I had to go in here first. Okay. Okay, I got gotcha. you. All right, let's get out of here. That's two levels down. Speed run. Power control, all right, all right. Oop, hang on. Almost forgot I was pistol starting. What do we got, three secrets, 103 enemies. Let's just make sure there's nothing in here first. So I love how the level human BBQ only had a BBQ at the beginning. Then after that, it was pretty devoid of, devoid of BBQs. I feel like backing myself into this corner was not the smartest move. Oh, you think Quake's release is having crossplay? That would be really cool. Because one thing that does bother me about, you know, selling games uh, cross platform is that if you're going to do it cross platform, I feel like you could try to make it something people can play together i mean like in some cases i might understand why they don't in like competitive games where people who play on a pc might have a clear advantage but for something like doom or minecraft right something akin to that let people play cross-platform just Wolfenstein. I know these levels are long, according to everybody, so I don't want to have to go back searching through a level if I can get away with it. And that's even assuming. That's even assuming it will let me go backwards. Because some people make maps like an asshole. Okay. 
Um, where did that bring me? Let me wait till I get to that area so I can clear that out a little bit. You still want them to release Half-Life on Nintendo Switch? That would be cool, but I almost don't think that's going to happen. Simply because... As it appears, Valve is quite content to just leave Half-Life and Half-Life 2 how it is. I mean, they won't give me a fucking Half-Life 3. I mean, people have been waiting so long. There's people who have died waiting for that game. And I don't think Alex counts. Well, you think about it. That, the... What was it? Episode 2 came out in... Yeah, Half-Life 2 Episode 2 came out in 2000... Seven? Yeah, I think it was 2007. So think about that. That's 14 years ago. Like, I'm not saying people have died of old age waiting for it, necessarily. But there's definitely people who played... In that, in that span of time, there's definitely people who played it. Who played Half-Life 2 and were waiting. And then just up and died before they could get a chance because Valve took its sweet ass time. They should be ashamed. And don't get me wrong, I've heard a lot of good things about Alex. And I'm sure Alex is actually is really good. Um, I don't know if I would consider that a proper sequel. Because, A, it's a prequel, although I have heard... See, I've, I've avoided playing the, or looking up the game. Because even though I don't think I'm going to ever own... I don't think I'm ever going to own the $1,000 headset you're meant to play the game on. Like, I, I legitimately don't think I'll ever own it. But on the off chance, I somehow, somehow find myself in a position where I might be able to play it. I've avoided looking it up, but I have heard that the story is actually relevant to the current mythos of of Half Life of the Half Life series. Despite it being a prequel, um, but I believe it's still mostly a prequel, and therefore can't be considered Half Life Three. It does give me hope since, you know, Half-Life Alex exists. It does give me hope that I'll see a Half-Life 3 before I die. What if Half-Life 3 is a VR game? I mean, in one sense, that would be really cool. Because with everything I've heard about Alex, they would make an absolutely fantastic Half-Life 3. But I do feel it would still be a bummer, especially for someone like me. Like, now maybe by the time Half-Life 3 comes out, the headset won't be $1,000. But I can't see if the starting price tag was $1,000 that I would see that go any lower than a few hundred. So, these are not secrets. You're not hiding them very well. I thought that, for some reason, that there was a, a ledge there. Oh, it's fucking right there. Mm. Oh, it is. It just snapped up.
So, I mean, I still think it would be a bit of a drag because, at least with Alex, it wasn't a Half-Life 3. So there weren't necessarily people who were, you know, the people who have been begging and hoping for information about Half-Life 3 would not be super disappointed by the existence of Alex. But assuming, like, Half-Life 3 is still being made... Oh, over here. Assuming Half-Life 3 is still being made, it's still going to be years out. So we're going to say there's people who would be waiting 17, 18 years at minimum wait, waiting for this game. And if they take that from people and hide it behind a, a giant fucking $1,000 paywall... I mean, that's not cool. And I hope they wouldn't do that. Now, some people might argue that at some point, Alex might be playable just on the PC with no VR. And, you know, make it balanced so that it is playable. But I still don't think that's very cool. Because they clearly made it with a certain vision in mind, which was VR. So anything that they gave me besides that is, a ch is like a cheap imitation. So even if they made a Half-Life 3 in VR and said, don't worry, it'll be out on... Um, it'll be out on PC eventually... I mean, I don't care. Give me my... Make me a Half-Life 3 that the people who were bored... Who have been, like, waiting for, like, 17 fucking years for a sequel... Can have their sequel. Because it, it already bugs me that I'll never probably properly play... Uh, Half-Life Alex, And someday I might end up just having to cave and watch some YouTuber play it. Because where am I going to... I'm a married man. With a, and, a, and a father. I don't have a th well, like 1300 disposable dollars lying around. Okay, I will admit this third secret is hidden a little bit better than the other ones. But I'm hoping I can just Wolfenstein it. I hope it's not something stupid like one of these teleporters brings me somewhere different. Can I even get in there? Okay. Is there a secret or something worth having in these places? Mm, no? I was on that first area so now I can't get it. That would kind of suck. Because, yeah, that teleporter is not letting me go back. I don't think it would be anything here. Let's try in here. So far, nothing obvious. I 
I feel safe saying there's nothing in here. Better not be something stupid like one of these stairs has a different texture. This is what I get for trying to play Final Doom blind. Now I'm l I don't know where anything is. Fuck it, I'm just leaving. Who cares? I'm pistol starting anyway. Wormhole? Well, the music suddenly just got a lot more epic. Eight fucking secrets! That's just ridiculous. That is nonsense. Nice chair you guys left me here, though. Why does the wormhole have chairs? Is the wormhole another name for the train in this place? No? Oh, I can shoot the head. I didn't think I'd be able to. I didn't know it would aim for the head specifically like that. I am FPS Doug. Uh, he's not supposed to be able to fit there. He is... Too tall. Yeah, he was way too tall for that. You could see his head stuck in the ceiling. Just get the guys through here. Might as well stock up, I guess. See, I thought there were pathways down here, so... I was trying to avoid going in that area because I figured I'd get flanked. But now I know I was afraid of nothing. There was no flanking to be had. See, like his his fucking skelly head is stuck in the ceiling. And the door shut behind me. And where did the revenant go? Hello down there. Oh, did you break the elevator? Stop eating me. Invisible pinkies are just bastards. They keep trying to eat my face. Okay, well that's a step up from what the other hallways had. I was not prepared for that. I am so confused by what I just saw. 
What the fuck was that? Why is there an exit there already? Where did the Revenant go? What is going on? What is life? Don't have a super shotgun. It would be excellent right about now. If I had one, it'd be cool. Man, why are people complaining about TNT being long when there's exits that are apparently, like, really fucking early on like that? I think you all are over-exaggerating. Oh, what is... what is this? Okay, seriously, what the fuck is this? How are you supposed to know this was there? Did you just ran they were hoping you would just randomly walk over it? Apparently it's not a secret. Oh, this isn't the same area. There is no chain gunner corpse. Clever. Very clever. You would have had me doubting myself. Well, I have no health left. Turns out trying to kill a revenant in close quarters is a bad idea. Seriously, another one? What the hell is making that clink, 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 clink noise? Let's go down here. What could possibly... Oh, this is fine. It's okay, everyone just work out your issues. I'll wait. Again. Again. He should not have been able to get through that door. Well, at least it sounds like they're killing the cacos for me. I just like taking stuff to the face, guys. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Yes, I'm aware that was my fault. Yes, Jay, this is TNT. I'm sure you'll have fun watching me play this. At least I've got the music upgraded. You guys really hear those pipes. God, I would really... Oh, for fuck's sake.
That's the level is beautiful. I was a particular fan of the second level, Human BBQ, that featured one BBQ human right at the beginning, and then the rest of the level had nothing to do with humans being BBQ. I think that was good game design. Okay, that's a ladder out of here. I mean, there was one clever piece of map making earlier in this level. level. Never. So, I mean, it's got that going for it. He just rocketed up that ladder. I find it kind of unfair that back in the day these things could kill me from above without me being able to see them. But the same could not be said for me. How come they had that height advantage thing going on? Oh yeah, go Quake. That fantastic piece of gameplay history that was. I mean, you can see that it was an important piece. Oh, fuck. I can see it was an important, important piece of video game history, but it certainly was not a super fun piece of video game history. Fuck. Fuck. I guess I just tr should try to get that shit. And then I ended up getting none of it. Okay, so I did that out of order. Okay, fantastic. I actually have some health back. That's good. Yeah, but Quake and Quake tried to make it actually 3D. Whatever. That obviously technically fixes the problem. My point is in Doom 2 here if the enemies were allowed to get me from were allowed to get me from way up high why wasn't I allowed to get them from way up high is my point these are lame secrets What's the point of that being a secret? Okay, well, I guess I'm up here now. Is there a way to get back to the other side in case I miss something? I mean, there was technically an exit back there that I could just get kind of hoping they would hit the arachnatron they did not hit the arachnatron that's just a sad time There we go. Oh shit. I'll let you guys handle this. I'll I'll hang out back here. Why is that just in the stairs?
shouldn't be surprised that he ran Tron lost that fight. He had taken down one, but I felt that was all he was going to get. I love how there hasn't been, like, any bullets in this level. They're like, hey, you get your initial 50, and then fuck you. Shotguns only, guys. file cool so I just totally launched myself into that son bitch so what was the point of that Yeah, but you can actually get to that egg super early in the level. That's what I did. I accidentally found it. I was like, why am I able to just leave the level this early? So I feel like the trigger that they have to open it opens up way earlier than they thought people would find it. They really didn't QA this wad or they at least this level very well. I mean, this Im mirror image motif they got going on here is clever in a way, but I mean, that's not what a wormhole is, so I feel like they're using the word wormhole incorrectly. I've been low on health this entire, t like, level two. It's been my fault. Because I'm, like, awful, but... Only three enemies left? Why would this be a secret and the other two not a secret? Well, uh, this level was really fucking weird. <laughs> Alright, I guess we're on to the hangar. Well, this map is clearly bigger than the other ones were. Alright, on map 5 already. But... That's where we're going to end the stream tonight. Thanks everybody for coming in. I much appreciate it. I'll be playing some Witcher on Friday and Saturday. At least that's the plan right now. Um, I hope you guys will stop by. If not, I'll see you guys on Monday for Doom Mod Monday. Where I will continue my Eve Eternity run. And hope it doesn't destroy me like Sunlust did. You're welcome for the Z's, Jay. You're welcome. Good night, Loser Corner. You all have a fantastic evening. Bye-bye. Now listen here, Sandy. You stay down, okay? Stay down. Cthulhu can't help you now. I think he's good. <laughs>